Hyantas. What's up, Hyantas? Um, today's gonna be a fun day. We're gonna be working on the truck. Little Mac! Uh, we're gonna give it a little wash. We're gonna debadge it. Taking off all the logos, the Toyota Tundra on the side, the SR5 up there. I got some plans. I want to add uh, a couple stickers, little Mac stickers, some vinyl. We'll see. That'll be a future project down the road. We can get the truck cleaned up. Just sits in the sun, bakes, and gets beat every day. So. I want to ceramic coat it here soon. I don't know if we'll get to that today. We're just going to be messing around with the truck, getting it up to speed as far as cleanliness. So let's get started. Let's turn on the swamp cooler. I don't want to sweat. You make me sweat, huh? Let's start off by getting this thing washed and then get it in the garage, get it out of the heat, and go from there and see what we want to do. Yeah, so we're going to remove this logo here. Taking off this bad boy, taking the sticker off. Already removed the Toyota Tundra. You see the remnants here. And the four wheel drive iForce V8 badge. Get rid of that. Bam, 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 get rid of that. I think we'll keep the V8 up here because it's Narnar. -nar. All right, we got the truck in position. We got far enough in to close it. We're gonna let the swamp cooler give us some love. So we'll shut the shop. All right, we're all set up here. Uh, we're gonna start removing the, the logo here. It's all one piece. Uh, what we're gonna do is, uh, these are glued on. So we're going to take our heat gun, we've got this at Harbor Freight at 20 bucks. And heat up, the idea is to uh, get the glue tacky, uh, get it in a more pliable state so you can remove the logo. You don't want to go full ham and start, uh, you know, melting the paint, the clear coat, but definitely want to get it heated up. We're going to take some uh, dental floss, not the most efficient, this stuff breaks pretty easily. Um, I need to get some fish in mine. Something a little bit stronger so it won't break when you're trying to 
what you do is you wrap it around your fingers like traditional dental floss, but you get it behind the logo and do a little sawing action to break that glue apart from the paint so you can remove the logo. So, let's get started. Let's get this baby heated up. Are you serious? You just broke, dude. Well, it's harder freight for you. Son of a bitch. This is gonna suck. Yeah, so get it over there. Oh, yeah. Go in the Harbor Freight right now to go get a fresh gun. No way, Jose. Oh, yeah, keep on coming, baby. Yeah, I'm probably gonna end right at that team. Oh, you had a Tundra. Oh, you had a little Mac. This is gonna suck. Heat gun broke, dude. Really? Yeah. Damn it. I wish that would have happened 20 minutes ago or an hour ago. I could have grabbed mine. What kind do you have? <laughs> Is it from Harbor Freight? No, I got it off Amazon for like 35 bucks. Nice. That was like 20 bucks, so. Yeah. Turned it on, it's all <laughs> clunk. Check it out, check it out. So, this for the most part is gone. These lights right here, the scan grip, you can see everything with them. So, from far away, you won't even be able to see the SR5. You come up close, you can see it. I'm gonna be putting a TRD badge right there. So, I'm pretty happy with the outcome. It looks a lot cleaner, more subtle, with no badges. But for today's project, we're gonna wrap it up. Truck looks good, nice to get it washed. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace out, hi Antis. <laughs>